Hey my bomb babies, I'm back again with another Born Pretty review for you guys. Um, before we get started, please subscribe to my channel if you don't already. Turn that notification bell on so you can get notified when I upload again. And also give me a thumbs up if you like this video. If we can get right into it. So Born Pretty sent me another PR package and we're gonna open it up and see what it is. So in the package they sent me, they sent me a base coat, a top coat, and also a matte top coat. So we're gonna be testing out all three of these today, and I'm gonna be doing them on these plastic, these plastic um, practice sticks for you guys. And we're gonna use two of the gel polish colors that they sent me in their last PR package. So the two colors that we're gonna be using are these two. You can't really tell from the front of the bottle until I take them out. But this one is Orphelia. And Orphelia looks like this. And the other one we're gonna be using is Cranberries. And Cranberries look like this. And one is gonna be a gloss top coat and one is gonna be a matte top coat. So, we're going to get right into the video. So, first, when you're doing, when you're dealing with, when you're dealing with um, gel polish, you want to always put a base coat down. So, we're going to start with their base coat on one of the fingers. Or actually, we're going to do both of the fingers. We're going to do them both at the same time. So you want to start with a base coat. So that's what we're going to use first is the Born Pretty base coat. And it's a 7 milliliter. And it has a nice clear, nice clear shine to it. You want to make sure the base coat is just nice and thin. You don't want too thick of a base coat. So that's one. And I'm gonna do the other one. And there should be enough still on my brush to do this one. And that's two. So for base coat, you're gonna cure it for 60 seconds in your gel lamp light. Okay, so after you cure them, they look like this. They're nice and clear. And that is the base coat. So we're gonna start off. Now we don't need the base coat anymore, so you guys can just go ahead and close it up. So now we're gonna start off with using Orphelia. And when you do gel polish, again, you wanna do two thin coats, not too thin where you see lines and streaks, but two coats of gel polish. So the nail can be nice and filled with gel polish. So you're just gonna paint the nail with the gel polish color of your choice. And you're gonna cure this for 60 seconds. Okay, and this is what one coat looks like of Orphelia. And now we're gonna go ahead and do the other one, which is cranberries on the other finger. One coat. And this is what one coat of cranberries looks like. And you wanna cure that for 60 seconds. And this is what one coat of cranberries looks like. So now we're gonna do two coats of the color. So I'm, since we just did cranberries, I'm gonna do cranberries again for the second coat. And I'm gonna go ahead and do Orphelia, a second coat. So 
So this is what they look like, second coat. Super, super cute. And you wanna cure them for 60 seconds. And so this is what it looks like with two coats of their color on to the nail. And now time for the top coat. So I'm gonna do Orphelia with the gloss and Cranberries with the matte because it's darker and I want to be able to see the matte. So we're gonna go ahead and close up our colors and we're gonna go ahead and do our top coat first. And you want just one coat of the top coat because top coat is pretty thick. Or it's not thick, but it's like you only need one coat. And this is what the top coat is looking like. And you cure that for 60 seconds. And this is what the top coat looks like. Super shiny, I'm loving it. Super shiny. So now we're gonna go ahead and close up our top coat. And we're gonna go to our matte top coat. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply that to cranberries. So it's gonna look shiny when you apply it because you have to cure it. Sorry, there's some hair in there. So this is what it looks like applied and you'll cure that for 60 seconds. And this is what the matte looks like. I love this so much because I love matte top coat all the time. Like this is super cute. So this is what they both look like next to each other. The glossy right here and the matte is right there. These are super cute. I definitely recommend like uh, these are really cute. So here's the top and the map and I know they're switched around but yeah yes I freaking love them so much I hope you guys really enjoyed this video again please turn that notification bell on to get notified when I do upload more videos give me a thumbs up if you like my videos and also subscribe to my channel if you don't already thank you again for watching this video and I hope to do plenty more reviews with you guys. Thank you so much for the support. Please go shop on my nail supply store website. It's www.bombnailsupplystore.com. And I will link that down below. You have plenty of nail supplies, everything you need. Thank you so much, guys. And I'll see you again.